Hey, welcome to Classic Performance, and uh, this being the uh, official start of the summer and summer boating season, it's a great day to be in the Carolinas, and even a better day when you've got a 33-foot Eliminator factory race boat, former factory race boat, vintage factory race boat, championship winning boat, two 540 Merlin's upgraded power plant, and we're gonna put this thing splash it in the water for the first time this season and uh, put some fire in the hole. You've seen this boat before on the channel last summer, the end of last summer, so you go back and check that video out. I'll put a link in the description, uh, but we're gonna go ahead and get it running and uh, see what happens. Take you for a ride. Yeah, so we're here for the first time. We're on the uh, the 33 Eliminator. We're gonna go ahead and open the hatch. You know, last time we looked at this boat back in uh, the late fall, we really didn't get a, a good look under the hood. But uh, you know, anytime you want to you start these things up, you want to open the hatch cover. It's not just for show. You want to be sure if there's any fire, any fuel leaks, any kind of issues, you can address them immediately. Uh, and if this catch was closed, uh, you put yourself at risk. But there they are, uh, the 540s. Alan, tell us just a little bit more about, I, I was probably not accurate, but uh, the headers, the injection, what do we got on here? This um, is uh, CMI headers um, with the Holly Pro injection system on 540 cubic inch, making just a tad over 700 a piece on 92 octane. And uh, we still got our-, our still, uh, We got a leak. <laughs> cooling in here. Yeah, I got a little, little dribble coming down here from something, yeah, but- I uh, saw that last year. Oh, I'll fix it. <laughs> nice serpentine belt with kind of the gooder, the, the gator, gator, gooder gator back belts, but you can see the fuel injection and uh, 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 the, the carbon painted uh, valve covers and breathers. But uh, yeah, still have the RV antifreeze and coolant in here from the from the season. So these things have not been fired up. But uh, with these catamarans, one of the things that's uh, versus a V-hole, look at the space in here, because yeah. these things are on either spots and so very easy to work on. If you had a V-hole, good luck getting to the... Turban the, fits right here. Yeah, yeah the <laughs> manifolds and everything else. So anyway, we're gonna we're gonna give it a start and uh, see what happens here. All right, so where are we? We are... That's just She's in the water and running. We're going to the gas dock and we're going to fill her up. So we're over here at the fuel dock. We're going to head and fuel it up. Uh, we'll back it in right here and uh, I'll probably put 100, 125 gallons of fuel in it uh, before we head out for the day.
that's how you do it. That's how we put the eliminator in, take the eliminator out, good little shakedown run, and uh, ready for the season. So we got Starla up here at the helm, and uh, we're gonna call it a day here. So if you like classic cars, boats, trucks, airplanes, and uh, and, and, and hot boats, uh, we got you covered. So take care, have a great day, and we'll see you next time.